Hi, Dress Your Cuties, Wendy here. Today we're going to draw Bendy, so let's get started. To draw cute Bendy, let's first start by drawing his eyes. So I'm going to come right here and draw a curve. So this is kind of like the bottom of the eye area, like where the cheek would be. And then with that curve, we're going to come about right in this area and draw a slight angle line. Then I'm going to go up, kind of drawing a Pac-Man, two angles, and then I'm going to round it off as if I'm drawing an oval. So I'm going to go up. So just make sure this part is pretty level and then just go up. Round it off to create your oval and then come right back down. So this curve that you've created here will determine the size of your eye. Then come back in here and just shade this all in. There. Then I'm going to come right across. So let's say about this wide. Just making mine a little bit cuter. So I'm going to make it wider. And I'm going to come about right here and draw another curve. So my goal is try to draw the same approximate size as the other eye. So now is my curve. And then once again, we're going to do the same thing. So come to that little angle. And then draw your Pac Man. And then come up. And I'll drag this point across since I'm drawing pretty big so that I'm approximately the same size, same height. Let's bring a curve down to create our oval and bring it in there. And once again, shade it all in. So Bendy is pretty much black and this very pale yellowish color. So, but today I'm just going to shade in the eyes probably because it's just too much black and it's just so much easier to just fill it in on the computer. So today I'll just fill in the eyes black for now. And then now that we have the eyes in, let's see here, let's draw the mouth. So in between the eyes, we're going to, let's see here, let's find my centers just so I know what I'm working with. So about right here, I'll give myself a point right there in the center. And from there, I'm just going to go ahead and use this as my center point and go up towards the eye and then we round it off. It's a little bit wider coming out. So same thing here. Use that as my guide. Come out, same bow, same area. And we're going to round it off to draw this kind of kidney bean shaped mouth. So right here. Go ahead and connect. There, a little tricky, huh? Okay, there, now that I have that, let's come back into the center area and we're going to draw a straight line down. So we're gonna start to draw some teeth. So this, it's up to you, maybe three lines on both sides. Just to evenly space everything. There. So then from there, I'm going to come to say about right here and just draw a soft curve over each eye. And then I'm going to come to the top and find my center. So a little bit above the eye, above the brow area. Let's say about right here. I'll give myself a point. From there, I'm going to go up on both sides. So we're going to go up a slight curve towards about right here, kind of maybe the center of the eye. And then we're going to bring this down. We're going to come close to the eye and go around it. So we're starting to create the face shape. So same thing here. Let's go up. Just like the other side, I'll drag a point across. So approximately the same height. Oops. And bring it down. Round the close to the eye. There. So bring this out a little bit wider. Okay, so then now that we have that, we're gonna bring in a curve. So let's find my center. And I'll just say about right here. I'm gonna give myself a point. And from there, I'm basically just going to go ahead and go nice and round to this point right here. So cuties, when you're drawing really big, it's just so much easier and everything is 
um, from the front perspective and everything needs to be same on both sides it's just easier to have points to help you see where you're going okay so now that we have that big curve in sorry for the mess we're going to go ahead and come back to the top so let's come back to the center come up say about this high I'll just give myself a point and from there once again I'm going to draw a curve so I'm going to go straight out and then about right here in this area I'm going to come up with a big curve I'm going to curve it up so same thing on this side I'm going to go straight a little bit and then about in that area we're going to go up So I'm going to create kind of these devil horns up here and then we're going to come down nice big curve and it's going to taper all the way back down to the face so just keep in mind as you come down you're going to get closer and closer to the face until you touch there so same thing on this side nice and round and start to taper it in about there so you always definitely can go back and if you need to adjust anything definitely do that this part's all black but like i said i'll just fill that in on the computer it's much easier that way <laughs> okay so now we're finally done with the head let's draw the cute little body so right in the center we're going to draw this cute bow so about right here we're going to skip a little bit of space and then we're going to draw this rounded off uh, like a little square rectangle nice and round and then we're going to bring down some loops we're going to curve down and come about right here we want a nice big bow and connect come in here with some details and same thing over here so just flop down this bow same thing here and about right here connect then from there let's come over about here and we're going to draw the little body so we're going to kind of angle it down and I'm going to make my bendy a little bit shorter so I'll say about right about right here I'll start to bring it in so then imagine this curve is going all the way but I'm going to skip a little bit of space about there and leave a little bit of space open because then from there we're going to come right back to the center so let's say about here and here we're going to start to draw the legs and so then about right here we're going to angle slightly bring it in angle slightly then right here we're going to put in his feet so just cut it off and then we'll work on this side first we're going to come down and then bring this out and about right here we're going to pop out this big shoe so big curve about right there and then I'm just going to go ahead and connect there so same thing here and pop this out about right there and then this nice big curve and connect there okay so then from there let's draw the arms so I'm going to come right here and we're going to pop out a curve and we want these huge hands in this area so I'll stop about right there it's going to get wider as we come out so it's thinner here and wider here and then we're going to cut it off about right there for these kind of Mickey Mouse looking gloves so I'm going to come right here for the cuff round it off and let's draw a big thumb and we're going to round it off around and curve for a finger then come back right here and we're just going to go ahead and draw a nice big curve and then another one and tuck it in 
but in this area I just draw a little curve and two ovals and I'll shade that in it's a very Mickey Mouse like right <laughs> okay so same thing on this side so about two right here it's gonna be a little bit thicker towards the end and cut it off and then round it off just like the other side and then a big thumb now round it off for some fingers come back over here one and then two whatever is easiest for you just play around with it and once again a little curve right here and then two ovals there and that is pretty much it for my drawing here of bendy i really hope you love how he turned out and i helped you draw him fun and easy today and if i did please make sure to give me a like and subscribe so you won't miss any new draw so cute videos see you later